Okay. I'm going to teach you how to put a background on that image. <coughs> Alright, you're going to start by opening your picture by clicking this button right here. And you're going to find your picture that you want. Oh, crap. I only have a limited amount of time, so this is going to not be very good, so just follow me. I have a cold, too. So, alright. Now you're going to click the polygon tool right there. And you're going to trace your image. And this is going to be horrible. Because like I said, I only have a little bit of time. I'm so excited though because I got my um, sound to work. I just figured it out. I was being so stupid. So I had to like type before. And good thing though because it wasn't... Because it was taking forever and I couldn't upload so on YouTube and now I got this and this takes up really fast. Hopefully. Alright. Sorry, this is really hard to keep the camera focused and look at the computer screen at the same time, so kind of bear with me. And then you can connect it, obviously. And then you're gonna right click and invert selection. And then for this picture, I like to use stroke, but I'll, you usually want to unclick stroke, but I'm going to keep it. And then you can choose your color here and your width. I usually like six, but it doesn't matter. And then, well, fill in fill pattern is already chosen, but you gonna wanna, you're going to want to uh, click it, click them both. I already have my back one, but I'll show you what to do. You're going to click the border button, and uh, you're going to go down. I have no idea why they have uh, patterns, because nobody uses them, but you're going to find your background. I'm going to use these polka dot colors, because they have, they're kind of like um, Valentine's Day colors. Or there's these, but I feel like using these more. And then you're going to click open. And then um, you can click preview it right here, see if you like it. If you like it, then cool. Click OK. And then there's your uh, background on your pick. Yay. By the way, that was my 60s phone. <laughs>